I read a study online that shows that people achieve more in life if they have someone else or something tell them what to do with their life. Most commonly things that I've seen the done are um, mostly on sitcoms or TV shows where it would either be a magic eight ball or some other device that is similar in concept. So I thought I would try to give this experiment a shot. But for me, I don't have a magic eight ball. So I found the next best thing that I had in my house. Dungeons and Dragons dice. All right, the first thing I need to do is pick a dice. Thing is, I have so many. So normally within a Magic 8-Ball, it is a 20-sided die within my research. So I have to go eliminate all of these and pick out a 20-sided die. So I came to the conclusion that I have 19 dice to choose from. So in order to decide which of the dice I will be using for this experiment, I'm going to individually roll to see which dice likes me the best. So let's say we're going to go based off normally, let's say the 20 sided dice. So we're going to say dice number one and we're going to see which one works the best. Okay, well we can't just go right off the bat, so we're going to try another one. Just to be safe. Okay, this was enough. Okay, that's a yes. Seventy-one dice rolls later. So after doing some extensive research, I found out that this particular dice is the one I'm going to use. Here's a zoomed in photo of what the dice looks like. So now I have um, a reference guide to see what is all on each and every side of the Magic 8 ball. With this, now with this die, I can now determine on how I should run my life. So let's see. It is now 9.45 in the evening. So let's see. Um, it's about that time where I would probably have dessert. Um, let's ask its first question. Should I go and have dessert? Let's see. Very likely. Okay, let's go dessert. What should I have though? Should I have ice cream? Nine. Positively. All right, we're having ice cream. Now, it's taken me a while to eat this ice cream since it's um, keto ice cream. Um, normally you have to, we got this hair in here. Normally you have to thaw it for about five, 10 minutes and then try to eat it. But even though you may thaw it out for five, 10 minutes, you still have a hard time eating it. So, still, excuse me, still trying to eat it. You know what they say, slow and steady wins the race. Okay, just finished my bowl of ice cream. And to prove it, here's my empty bowl of ice cream. Um, it's getting a bit late. Um, I'm going to see if the dice will let me go to bed. Let's see. Cannot foretell now. But I want to go to bed. Can I please go to bed? Focus again. Focus and ask again later. Ugh. Come on. Um. Can I go to bed? Please. No. 
Um, so, what do you want me to do? Stay up all night? Focus and ask again. Do you want me to stay up all night and not go to sleep? Yes? Um, okay. Maybe I'll stay up and, uh, I don't know, I haven't had it done all night or in forever. Um, let's see how it goes. I mean, it's kind of weird how it told me where I had to stay up for for a long period of time and I really couldn't sleep, but I think it will eventually allow me to get in some amount of hours of sleep because I do have to get into work in the morning and I'm hoping that I'm not too loud for all the other people in the house, so I want to make sure that I try to keep on with the experiment and try to be as quiet as can be, so maybe I could try to listen to some music, um, play on my Switch, or um, maybe listen to some movies, music, while um, the time passes, um, and try to see Come if the on. dice will let me. Do you think that the dice will let you do that? I'm pretty confident the dice will um, be willing to um, do that for me. Alright, it is 9.30 on it's a morning of the, I guess still day one of the dice experiment. Um, still a bit sleepy. Um, the dice allowed me to get maybe only 20 minutes of sleep after I asked very politely. So, they were fortunate enough to allow me brew some coffee and hopefully I can use this to um, keep my energy up through um, this next day and hopefully at um, some point I can try to ask to see if I can get some more sleep. Ugh, why is there oil in here? So I've come to some conclusions on this experiment. One, fate is cruel. And two, it won't let me do anything fun. But it's a new morning, and I'm hungry, so let's see if they'll be polite and have me some good breakfast. Should I have some bacon and eggs? Consult me later. Alrighty, we're starting off strong. <clears throat> um, maybe I'll ask that question for another time. Um, let's see. What out... <clears throat> should I make toast? That roll doesn't count. It was not on the pad. So let me ask again. Should I make myself toast? Star say no. Alright, um... How about... me I'll ask that bacon and egg question again. Can I have bacon and eggs? Unlikely. Um, okay, um, can I have, um... Let's see, um, can I have maybe something leftovers? Can't say now. Um, what about, um, maybe something simple, some cookies. I think that's a, don't bet on it. Um, well, what am I supposed to do? Eat a jar of mayonnaise?
Good mayonnaise. Since eating that jar of mayonnaise, the dice have been fair on telling me what I should and should not be doing. Like sitting down at the dining table, or not being able to sit on the couch and watch television. But it was reluctant in letting me take a shower for the first time since 24 hours. And for lunch, I thought it would tell me I could have something splendid. But instead, it told me to have a bowl of nuts. Well, at least it's better than having a jar of mayonnaise. But we'll see how what happens when I have to go to work. All right, so off to go to work. Um, guess I'm bringing the dice with me to continue the experiment. I uh, don't know how it's gonna go, but first let's see where the dice will take me. So, should I take the long route to work. Unlikely. Well, maybe there's an accident that I don't know of. So, should I then take the short route? Focus and ask again later. All right, um, well, there is another way. So, should I go through town? Consult me later. Well, should I just go to any route? No. Can I go to work at all? Don't bet on it. I need to go to work. Um, can I please? Like, pretty please? No. I have to. I don't know why you're letting me do this, but please, can I go to work? No. 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 Can't you give me anything else but no? Answer unclear, ask later. Um, well, I don't have time for later. So, can I please go to work? Just blow one out of it. We'll ask it again. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I could always use a holiday. So, if you won't let me, should I call off from work? No. Well, I guess I'm playing hooky for now. Um, well, I guess I don't need this jacket. <clears throat> Only the experiment for science and the mystic arts. So, what could go wrong? It is now day, oh, whatever. I don't think I'm even keeping track anymore. It's just gone so bad that it's not even fun anymore. It's now torture.
Torture to the point where I'm not having fun. Like, for example, can I tell the folks at home how I'm feeling about this experiment? Start saying no. You see, I can't even tell you guys how I'm dealing with this ex experiment. Well, do you know what? I'm going to tell them about this experiment. This experiment sucks. I don't even know why I tried to do this in the first place. I mean, you want to know how my week's been going? I mean, I probably lost the footage, but I'm going to tell you how my week is going. My week has been hell. I mean, there were, I couldn't even go into work this week. The dice tell me I shouldn't. They're, I can't even tell them. They think I'm dead right now. I mean, they don't know. How am I supposed to know? I can't even leave my house. The dice won't let me leave my house. The only time I ever did leave my house was to try to get, get more food and other things. And it wouldn't let me go out and do stuff. I've been homesick for a long, long time. Um, let's see what else happened. Um, well, I haven't been sleeping. I haven't been sleeping at all. Probably got a few power naps after begging and pleading and trying to bribe it with stuff, trying to get me to go to sleep, which hasn't been really working and it's been making more money than I have been making money this week. And, um, uh, uh what else? Um, well, um, I'm being mal, now mal, mal, malnutritioned that now, um, I can't even eat right anymore. Um, uh, I've been eating a lot of scraps and um, there are times where I had condiments and there was even a day where I had to eat nothing but pickles and drink pickle juice. And ever since then, everything has been tasting like pickles. Mm. Pickles. I came into this thinking that it was gonna be fun. But I may have taken this a little too seriously. I mean, I don't even know why people didn't do this in the first place. I mean, why do they even do it in, in, the, in the movies and sitcoms? Probably just for good laughs. So I... Was this a whole thing just joke upon myself? Ugh. Anyway, I started this experiment coming in. You know what? I conclude that starting now that no one needs to do this. Ever. And if you do, make sure you get a proper magic eight ball. So. I'm going to bed. <laughs>